I'm at BET 2019 with Jackson, who's going to tell me about the organization Girls Who Code. So Girls Who Code is a nonprofit organization that's dedicated to addressing the gender gap in technology, which really means the fact that across the world, technology jobs are mostly held by men. And can, tell you, can you tell me who sort of, what, where the genesis, where, where it started from, the whole organization, who started it and what its aims are? Yeah, so the organization was started in the U.S. by Reshma Sajani, who was running for Congress. Um, and as part of her, her campaign, she visited a number of classrooms in New York City and found that the computer science classrooms that she visited were really dominated by boys. Um, and so she founded the organization to get girls excited about computer science. Um, and we do that by running free after-school programs. And how long has it been going and how successful has it been in the States and why are you over here? Yeah, so the organization has been extremely successful in the United States um, and we think that it's been successful because um, it's really inspired girls to pursue uh, careers in computer science and technology. Uh, so we're excited that Girls Who Code alumni major in computer science at a rate 15 times the U.S. national average. Uh, and so far we've reached over 100,000 girls and at this point in the school year we have over 6,000 after school programs getting started. Um, and we were excited to to expand to both the Canada, to Canada and the UK um, because we wanted to reach more girls across the world and notice that both countries have very similar issues when it comes to the gender gap in technology. Okay, and so um, how long have you been in the UK and what are your plans to sort of expand and some of the partnerships you hope to make? Yeah, so we've been in the UK since November, uh, so just a few months now, uh, and we're excited that over 10 programs are going to be up and running soon. Uh, we're hoping to launch over 100 clubs by the end of the school year, um, and really looking to build partnerships with schools, libraries, um, and the organizations that work directly with them. Thank you very much.